Nice. Pop that right up in the air next to the hole. Let's talk about how Kenzie just did that. So now we're getting closer to the green. So with shorter shots means shorter swings. So Kenzie, let's talk about this one. If you made a full swing here, what would happen? I uh, would hit it way over the green. Yes, way over the green and have just another tough shot. So as you get closer to the green, you need uh, more loft on your club. She's using the most lofted club on, in her bag, the one that has the face aiming the most upward. Then instead of making a really wide swing or wide stance and having a, a really long swing, she's got her feet closer together. That makes it easier to execute the shot. And then her back swing, the club head itself is barely getting over about where her waist would be. And then in the follow through, she's making it about the same length. I would keep using the same form and the same club and the same swing style for everything. The way that you'll vary this is that if you get further from the hole, make a little longer swing. So go ahead and make one that's longer. Then as you get closer, if we got right up to the edge of the green, then her backstroke might only be about that long. That's it. I mean, those are really the basics of it. Now the strategy here, as you get started, the first thing you want to do is just hit this shot onto the green somewhere so that you can pull out your putter for the next one. And we'll talk about that in the next video. As you get better though, that's when you can start aiming at the flag. But for now, first time out, just getting into golf, just get this thing on the green. So Kenzie, pull this one off one more time. Nice. So that's the basics for how to hit a little shot around the green. Go ahead and go on to the next video. We'll start talking about what to do now that you're on it.